Jesus, take the what? I'm so confused. I'm breaking a sweat. Um, what? Here I need you. Yeah. Small, just a little bit. Try just a little bit. Hi everyone, I hope you're well. I'm coming at you today really with an impromptu video. So, I made an order the other day on ASOS because I've been looking for like the perfect pair of mum jeans for summer and I ended up ordering like eight pairs of jeans. I thought why not do a little video of me trying out all these jeans on because as a bigger girl, I can tell you it is difficult trying to find a pair of jeans in general. Never mind mum jeans because you have to make sure they're oversized. If you've got a smaller waist and bigger hips and it's all a bit mad around the waist and oh, it is literally very hard work. So my room's a bit messy, like I've not done anything properly. It's just a bit, I'm just coming at you with some, you know, raw. I'm coming at you raw and also it's light outside and then I have my I hope the lighting's okay I hope the background's okay I think it's gonna be all right bish bash bosh we're just gonna go through some of the jeans that I bought from ASOS and see which is the best mum jean I want to do more videos on jeans so like I was gonna do a whole series like battle of the blessed battle of the best skinny jeans battle of the best mum jeans like from loads of different brands like in one video I'm like find the best ones and I still am going to do that it's just going to take a bit more planning so for in the meantime I'm trying to find me a good pair of mum jeans for this summer okay so let's just get started I'm gonna have to stand all the way back here so I'm going to project my voice and hope that you hear me until I get um, a microphone these are my first pair of jeans let me actually get the receipt these are the ASOS design curve Farley highway slim mum jeans and these are actually in the sale so these are 16 pound and I got them on a 24, length 32. And you know what? I like these. Like for the first pair of jeans, I actually do like them. The colour is like a proper 90s blue wash. Yeah. The thing is, so let me run you through it. So this is what the um, the waist situation is looking like. Because obviously I have a smaller waist bigger hips so trying to find any high waist mum jeans is going to be a bit difficult these are good to be honest like for the most part these are good because i've had some jeans in the past that were a lot worse than this zip i really like the cut of the jean like to be honest they're not really that much of like a mum jean i don't know for me i feel like a mum jean has like a bit of a wider leg or is that a boyfriend jean? I don't know. Just like, you know, a bit of a wider leg. But the legs are wide and I do have big legs. This denim has a little bit of stretch to it. So looking at the website, they are 95, no, 99% cotton, 1% elastine. I thought they had more elastine than that because these are really comfortable. They don't feel like that. You know, like that starchy feeling jean that's like so tough and like hard to move. No, these are, these are movable, you know. I can be kicking around. Also, I've got a little test here. So, I've got a stool and I'm going to sit on the stool because you know sometimes like when you're wearing jeans and they're like the jeans that don't move and you sit down and you literally are like, <gasps> like they just go so tight and you can't breathe and you can't do anything. So I'm going to seat, I'm going to seat test them. Stool test. Emma Thompson stool test. Oh, you know what? I'm just looking, there's a mirror behind the camera. But they actually look okay when you sit down. For me, because like wearing a high-waisted jean, like when you sit down, it can sometimes just like make your stomach bulge and like look massive. But these are kind of sucking me in and it, there's like definition up in my waist. Oh, that's okay. These jeans pass the test. These jeans are a yes from me. Next pair. Okay. Okay. I've run into a problem. What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> These are the ASOS Design Florence Authentic Straight Leg Jeans. Okay. And I'm doing this because they don't fit. So I'm really confused because the way I'm getting out of breath, put these jeans on. These jeans were 24 and the jeans I just had on were 24. And the ones I just had on were too big for me. And these jeans 
won't even pull up. Okay? And they're both ASOS brand, so it's not like one's a different brand. So these jeans, without showing you too much of my knickers, these jeans, like, they don't have a zip. They are just buttons all the way up. But what I can understand by putting them on, they're not high-waisted. Now, for me, that's a cardinal sin. To have a jean that is not high-waisted. Listen, if you have a tummy, like mine, this jean that sits here is going to do nothing for you. It is not going to look nice. And I think a lot of people who um, are insecure about their stomachs think, oh, wearing a high-waist jean, they're more scared of wearing a high-waist jean, but it's like, hun, you wear the high waist, it sucks you all in and defines your waist. This mid-rise jean, I'm gonna leave that to the size 10s because boys, they won't even do up. To be honest, the legs do fit which is good because i have big legs but honey honey 24 should fit these obviously run small they obviously run small and they're not big booty or big tummy friendly so these ones i'm gonna have to say please take a seat you're not invited to the party you're not summer appropriate you're not summer friendly you're not trying to be my friend you're not even trying to help me out here I'm kind of scared about these two. Oh boy, what? Sorry, what? She, Jesus, Jesus, take the we what? I'm so confused. Okay, I am so confused. I'm breaking a sweat. Um, what? These are from New Look, but sold on ASOS. New look curve wide leg crop jean, but if there was any footage that I can use right then of me putting them on, if there's not too much nakedness, this was mental to get on. So I think, because they're not big on my waist, maybe a tiny bit, I think that they like really make these to the shape of your waist. So then if you're trying to get them past your hips, it's kind of a no-go. Like to get them past your hips is gonna be struggle, but for them to fit here, but the thing is, these don't have any stretching. So like, you're not gonna be comfy in these at all. These are 24 as well. And they only just fit. Like these are made a bit crazily. The pocket's all the way up here. My bum is here. Confused. I'm confused. I like the legs though. So the legs are like wide. The legs are wide and like frayed, like sort of cropped. Yeah, I really like that, but the tummy area can you see how tight that is and it's giving me camel toe a jean should not give you a camel toe these are not comfy i'm not even going to bother sitting down in them because i'm uncomfortable stood up i can't even it's hurting already these are a no-go they fit but they just feel like they're <laughs> feels like i'm wearing Spanx, but it's jeans that's crazy like how i genuinely thought i would not get these past my bum but i got them on but I don't want to keep them on. I'm mad though because to find like a nice wide leg pair of jeans is hard. But oh well, the search continues. Let me tell you, they were just as hard to get off as they were to get on. And I've never actually worn a pair of jeans that were genuinely painful to, to put on or off. Wow. I would hate to think what I'd be like wearing them after a full meal. Okay, these are the design curve Farley high waist straight leg jeans in stone wash blue. These are kind of like the other ones that I wore in the beginning. So I like the colour and everything. These seem more like a mom jean, like, but because I have big legs, you won't be able to see probably, but because I have big legs, like the ankle is sort of like boot cutting. Do you know what I mean? And like, no one wants to wear a boot cut. The waist is still big. Um, I think I prefer the first ones to these. Because this is like a kind of an odd blue colour. It's like it's kind of weird blue. It's not dark blue. It's not light blue. It's like, you know, I don't know. It's just a weird colour blue, I think. I don't really feel the type of way about these. These were kind of hard to get on. But not, not as difficult as the others. But let's sit down. 
see when I sit down I'm kind of feeling a bit uncomfortable and if you can see it's digging in and like yeah these aren't that comfortable to sit in and if you look let me just undo this if you look here you can see how they are big and going down at the back it's not a cute look is it no it is not these aren't bad though they aren't that bad to be honest and they are they are a nice fit on the legs and they're not mad uncomfortable but still they're not the ones for me okay these look interesting these are off only ones with like distressed knees so let me tell you a little story any mum jeans i've had in the past i've always had like rips in them but the thing about me is i have really big legs so if the rips were on the thighs i'd sit down or over time like they'd just bust open and it happens pretty quickly with me and like mum jeans that have distressed bits on them like i just make them even worse to the point i can't wear them so i've had to sell like two pairs of jeans where literally the whole thigh was exposed because my big thighs rip them and that's why i always say like that i sit in the jeans to see what they're like because whenever i sat in jeans that were distressed that were mum jeans my thighs bulged out you know i need something breathable baby the rips are only on the knees so we will see what it's saying i keep putting my foot through the holes <laughs> These are the Design Curve Farley High Waist Slim Mum Jeans in Bonnie Wash with super wide busted knees. So basically, these are the exact same jeans from the first ones we tried on, I think, but with big knee gaps. Busted, open, hey. Yeah, you know what? I actually really like that. I think, let me sit down. Let me sit down. Yeah, when you sit, because there's a little bit of elastic to this jean, it's not like my skin is bulging out of the holes. Like, I don't think the holes would become any bigger. I can't guarantee anything. But I don't think they'll become any bigger purely because it's on the knee. So it's in the space that's, like, not exactly going to bulge out and, like, make it bigger. And when I sit down, my knees are comfy in these. Like, it's not like my skin is being pinched or anything like that on my thigh. So to be honest, I really like that. And I think that 1% elastine really makes a difference. The ankle is just like, it's like a straight leg jean. It's not really like a mum jean, but I think the wash makes them kind of like mummy. And because it's not a dead skinny, skinny jean, I really like these. These are also on sale, £17.50. Isn't it funny how the two pairs of jeans that I like the best are both on sale? I'm just saying. But yeah, I think you could. And let me put a belt on it and see what it's like. You know, if you're wearing your jeans high-waisted and they're too big around the waist, you can always whack a belt on. This belt is from ASOS ages ago. ASOS Curve always has a load of belts in the curve section, if you didn't know. So but look at that. That's going to keep your jeans up. And I really like, like the bum. The bum is like really... Wow, that's actually quite good. I feel like no jeans except fashion over jeans like do bits on my bum but these are actually looking okay you know two big pockets here i like the stitching the stitching color is nice you know usually i hate yellow stitching but i think because the wash is dark and the yellow is not too bright more like a brown stitch yeah they look really good i really just like these jeans in general i think they're really nice i'm getting like a dry mouth i need some water i just can't get over how comfy these jeans are for something that is like a straight leg jean or like a mum jean because to me a mum jean just reads as uncomfortable because as a bigger girl like it's just hard to wear fabrics that are very stiff and they never fit properly like around your waist and all of that jazz but these are very comfortable and i think i will both keep both of them pairs like the one with no rips and the ones with rips because they're just so comfy and i think having like this kind of more straight leg jean does look really fashionable as opposed to like just wearing really skinny jeans so i have jeans from fashion nova and stuff but i feel like i only wear them they're dead skinny and really stretchy but i feel like i only wear them like if i'm going on a night out or going out for dinner like i don't i don't feel like they look cool do you know what i mean like i like to wear outfits that look cool so i feel like this kind of jean you can wear it and it will look 
really suave and you can make it look you know your style let me move on i have a pair of shorts and a dress and a skirt so let's move on to them bits too also this top is from asos as well i just got this in the hall because i thought you know mom high waist mom jeans white t-shirt is so 90s like i just feel like it would really go and it is going so this t-shirt is just six pound it's just the ultimate crew neck t-shirt um i got it what size did i get it in i got it in a 24 i got it in a 24 but i think maybe i should have got it in a 22 or even a 20 because with this kind of t-shirt i would just tuck it into my jeans and because it's so over oversized like it's sort of baggy like i would like it to be a bit tighter like on the top do you know what i mean maybe i'll get it in another size as well it's only six pound i might get it in like a 20 as well so i can have one that's tight and one that's bigger because sometimes it is nice just to wear like really oversized you could just tuck it in up here and have it like dead chilled out yeah i feel like this is just an essential that everyone needs it's a little bit see-through but i've just got a white bra on so it looks really cute you could like wear a really cute bralette under this but yeah let's move on let me try on the shorts because they're something different that i've wanted for ages and i bit the bullet hopefully they fit i'm not expecting too much though oh my god it's that it's this thing again this doesn't give me much hope okay okay i hate this whole like loads of buttons things because it's just a nightmare like what if i want to go for a wee i'm just gonna be in there for about 10 hours because i've got nails you know this thing isn't easy i'm not gonna lie i love it <laughs> these will not be for everyone these will definitely not be for everyone but they are the curved denim high rise long line short in midwash blue so basically it's just a pair of shorts but they end like right above your knees and i feel like they're giving me such like old school little tomboy skater vibes so i just got them because i thought wow i've not just seen anything like that yeah they fit really well <sighs> i am shook so they're just high-waisted jeans kind of like yeah they they like don't have much movement let me check the ingredients i mean the materials these are 100 percent cotton so yeah these are 100 percent cotton so that means they have no stretch in them at all but they fit really well like they're not even too big on my waist like not crazy big on my waist wow these are made very well maybe it's because like there's no bottom half of the of the pant like they're just made better i don't know oh no i'm getting a bit of a camel toe fat pussy girl maybe i just need some full cotton bridget jones pants to wear these shorts like i don't wear denim shorts because they're just like uncomfortable and they, they are never like fit right around my thighs but this is a perfect alternative like and i think some people would think this looks really uncool and like really granny but i think it looks so chic and cool I'm just imagining this with like a little pair of like sling back shoes, do you know what I mean? Or maybe even trainers. These will look so good with Converse. Oh my days. And these are like so good for me because all you have to do is get your calf out. You're not even getting your thighs out if like that's something you're self-conscious about. I can't get over these. They fit so well. I cannot recommend them enough. Wow. What would they look like if they were a little shorter? Even if they're a bit shorter, you know, even if I cut them a bit, they would look so cute. Maybe I will cut them. <sighs> now I want to I wanna cut them now. Oh no, that is so cute. Okay, my battery is flashing, so I'm going to have to wrap this up. So this is the curved double breasted mini skirt. I got this in a 24 and I really think I should have got it in a 22 because it's kind of big but I didn't know what material it would be so yeah it's kind of like it has movement definitely it's kind of like a springy material so something to keep in mind. I do really like it I like the colour and if, if it fit properly it would fit like like this so kind of like a line oh it's so cute i think that is so cute but it is i don't think i would wear this because it is too short for me yeah like we're just we're just covering booty cheek i would have to wear cycling shorts under it or yeah it's just like not a good length for me like if it was 
hit in there. That would be a good length, but then still high-waisted. But yeah, this is so cute, definitely, if you if your legs aren't as long as mine. But yeah, man, definitely a cute little summer piece, but also kind of like a workwear piece as well. You could definitely wear this in a workwear way if it was long enough. But yeah, it's just too big for me, and you can see like it's pulling down and the top doesn't look right with it. But this is definitely really cute. It's only £25 as well, so yeah. I wish this fit it and it wasn't so short, but here, yeah, mm, mm, yeah, let me do the last dress before I die. Okay, so finally, this is the curved button through linen midi sundress in floral print. And I think this is so cute. I really love the cut of the dress right here. Like, I think that's such a nice little bit of tailoring, like this square kind of neckline. I thought this wasn't going to fit because I got a 22 instead of a 24 and it is just linen so there's absolutely no stretch in it but I actually think it fits quite well like it's quite form fitting around here but it's not like clinging too much if I wanted to be really comfortable in it I would get a 24 but I think it looks so good I think it would be so cute with a little belt maybe like a white belt or something with like a tortoise shell kind of print it would look so sweet so it just goes right past my knees and it's just a cute little sundress oh my god i feel like i just want a straw hat and like to be a little girly girl because you guys know this is not really my style but it's summery and cute and i just thought why not oh my god i'm thinking about the looks with this i really want to keep it it's so cute oh my god i'm in love oh stop it there's pockets there's pockets in the dress guys there is pockets the more i look at it the more it's really growing on me I don't know what shoes I'd wear with it. Maybe just like a little sandal. Oh, a little lace-up sandal. Simply B has a nice lace-up sandal at the moment. Maybe they'd be cute. Yeah, overall, I love it. Oh, also, one more thing I have to show you. I didn't actually get this from ASOS. I got it from Adidas, but it is on ASOS at the moment. I feel like this is completely sold out on Adidas because when I tried to buy the other color, they'd sold out and they had limited sizing in this. Dee dee dee. These are the, I think they're the young ones. These were £100. They're on ASOS at the moment, both the colourway. So there's orange and I think there's like a red and blue. Just like a really cute, chunky, 90s vintage trainer. And a lot of people think this is disgusting. I know my parents do, but I just love colour like, and I love trainers like this. And I've got another pair of these. Well, they're just like this, but they're called Adidas Falcons. And they're like in a pink and grey colour. And they're so comfy, so I got this one as well. And they're on ASOS as well at the moment. I just love them. Hello. Okay, so that is everything I have to show you today. This was like a really impromptu kind of haul, but I hope you enjoyed it. My lips are looking a bit crusty right now. I really hope you enjoyed this video. And I hope it gave you some insight into like the different type of jeans that are on ASOS. Just like different types of mum jeans and like the fits of stuff. I always get my jeans from ASOS. Like the best places for me for jeans personally are ASOS, Fashion Nova and New Look. But it, they can all be hit and miss. But usually they're my three favourites when people ask me where I get my jeans from. But like I said, I do want to do some like Battle of the Jeans videos. So let me know if you'd be interested in seeing that. I just feel so cute and summery like in this dress. I'm just going to go and take pictures right now. So... Thank you all so much for watching. I will see you very soon. I've got a vlog coming this week and possibly a girl talk, if you want that. Actually, I already know you want that. But yeah, make sure to follow me on Instagram. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, man. We want to keep this family growing. I want you to be here with me. And yeah, make sure you keep up to date with me and everything. Always on Instagram. You know the drill. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you very soon. Bye everyone. Yeah.